you guys welcome to another video sorry i haven't posted a video in a long time but today i'm going to show you how to make a translator so let's just get to the design and let me show you what i have designed so far so i have put two text inputs one is enter where the user can t enter the text they want to translate and the other text input or c will be the text that the translated text and these two buttons are the um, languages you can translate in and you need to put a button translate to translate text and you need to put an invisible component which is translator and you can see target language is what languages you're allowed to um, translate it into so you have to make sure you choose one from this list only and French and Hindi happen to be on there so I just use that so on blocks you're gonna create two variables um, variable French and variable Hindi. Now, you have to create a variable for every language you do. So I've created two variables. Now what I've done is I've separated the variables to language and to zero. Now when the screen opens, you're going to set the hint for both the text to type here. You're going to set the text to nothing. And you're going to set a variable and for, for both of them to zero. Coming on, when you press button French or if you press button Hindi, what it's gonna do is it's gonna set a, var a variable to one. It's gonna set the hint to whatever you want, and you have to set the text to nothing so the user is able to type in something. Now, coming to when button translate is hit. So when that happens, now if that variable is set to one because when you click it it'll set it to one so when you do it then it'll set the target language the meaning the language will translate it into that language then it'll translate that text so text to translate will be text in input so um, that's the text the user texted in, and text receive will be result because this result will be this the text translated, and then you have to set that at variable to zero, and you just do the same thing for the other languages. So thank you for listening. Hope you enjoyed that video, and please stay tuned for my next video. And I'm gonna be talking about simulations in my next video on Thunk Cable. So bye bye.